sheets of ice stretching as far as the eye can see. Hudson Bay in the Great Canadian North is polar bear territory. Several are still roaming around, waiting for the ice to freeze, before embarking on their great journey towards the Arctic ice cap, where they will spend the winter. This pre-migration period is the only time of year where the species can be observed up close. One can drive for hours or even days in these ghastly landscapes without encountering a single life form. But the spectacle is worth the wait. It's so beautiful. It's clear fur. It's pretty face. With the snow on its nose. It's really something. It's a curious and self-assured animal. It stands on the top of the food chain, so it's not scared. Polar bears are the world's largest carnivorous predators, and during this fasting period, their sense of smell is extremely developed. In recent years, a new tourism industry has formed. People now flock from all over the world to see these graceful and ferocious beasts in their natural habitat. I like to see animals in the wild instead of in the zoo. They look a lot more energetic here. It took five days of searching to spot this bear, but in the end, it was all worth it, as this male puts on a rare show, a fur cleaning ritual. The polar bear's coat is an essential camouflage tool for hunting, and to keep it white and bright, it has to rub every inch of it against the snow. Churchill is the only town in the world that's located on a polar bear migration path. Here, animals have gotten used to humans, and if they mostly come to steal food, residents must also be careful to lock their snowmobiles. A situation that could be amusing if it didn't represent a deadly danger for the population. Leaving trash outside is strictly forbidden, and to keep the bears at bay, a team of rangers has been dispatched to patrol the town. Sometimes we'll be patrolling along these roads and find a bear, you know, wandering along the coast or coming off the ice. Just because we can't see them doesn't mean they're not there. They may be laying down, uh, resting next to a big piece of ice. Yet not everyone is careful enough. This man is feeding his dogs outside, despite being surrounded by three curious and furry bystanders. But so far, Churchill residents, both human and bear, have managed to keep the peace.